flag of the Laomong SGU is Nathaniel Per Beal. Appropriately, the SGU flag is carried by this young man, a descendant of Hmong soldiers and airmen who fought with the American forces in Laos during the United States Secret War. Welcome to be seated. Now I welcome to the stage Commissioner Bill Holland, who will introduce Representative Proma. special friend of the Hmong community since his uh, election back in 2006. He serves on uh, the Financial Services Committee, the Science, Space, and Technology Committee, um, and also the Committee of Rules and Organizations of the U.S. House. He also has uh, helped uh, in uh, supporting the Hmong's effort by introducing and successfully in the House a bill that will provide special funding for this project. It is my honor and great privilege to introduce Congressman Okoye. Good morning, everyone, and uh, we were just talking about what a glorious Colorado day we have uh, for this event and this ceremony. I want to thank you, Commissioner Olin, uh, for your introduction and your friendship. And as a long time supporter of the Lao Mong community, I truly am honored uh, to be here today and to be part of this unveiling ceremony and the flyovers uh, conducted uh, by our military. and. Uh, got the Marines in the Air Force, and I'm not sure who else is here, probably somebody from the CIA, I would imagine, but they won't tell us. During the Vietnam War, the Hmong soldiers and airmen served bravely alongside U.S. soldiers and saved thousands and thousands of Americans in South Vietnam and Laos. During the 1960s and 1970s, the U.S. Central Intelligence Agency recruited the Hmong to fight in the secret war in Laos against the communist Patet Lao and the Vietnamese. However, in America's withdrawal, we left many of these loyal allies and their families. Since taking office, I have worked with my colleagues 
in the Congress to acknowledge this wrongdoing and work to educate the public about their contributions and honor your service and their service. In 2015, I introduced a resolution to declare July 22nd the Lao Mong Recognition Day to recognize the bravery, sacrifice, and loyalty exhibited by the Hmong people. In 2017, Hmong veterans were among hundreds, uh, among the hundreds my office recognized as one of the several pinning ceremonies to recognize Vietnam era veterans. Here today, again, I want to thank you all for your service and for your patience for his recognition. It's been a long time coming. In years following the war, many Lao Mong emigrated to the U.S. and now proudly call America home. Our community and our nation are lucky to have you here as friends, neighbors, and colleagues. This year, my office submitted a funding request to support the construction of this national memorial. The National Lao Mong Memorial will be an expression of our country's appreciation for the service and support of the loyal and freedom-loving Lao Mong people and will serve to educate, inform, inspire visitors now and for generations to come. We're very fortunate in the city of Westminster Park. I also want to thank uh, Josh Zeigelbaum, who is here. He's a clerk for Adams County, again, where the memorial will be located. We have generals, we have uh, council members, we have clerks here to honor uh, this memorial and to honor the Lao Mung for their service and sacrifice. I will continue to push for the funding for the memorial, but I'm pleased to be here today as the first step of this significant project. I would like to thank especially uh, Yang Chi, who, yeah, Bill Holland, John Haran, and so many others, uh, it's hard to name everybody, who took this project under, you know, their authority to get it done. And we've been working on it, I'd say, 15 to 20 years but it is coming to fruition because of their work and the work of so many. big flag and it's getting a little breezy up here. Um, thank you for helping with that. But as I was saying, this project's been underway. It's been through the imagination and inspiration, particularly, yeah, somebody should just hold it. recognize the service that you and so many of your comrades provided to the United States uh, during the Vietnam War. So, as part of the National Defense Authorization Act, which uh, we just passed from the House to the Senate, I helped secure an amendment to make sure Hmong veterans who fought in the war can be buried at VA National Cemetery. You served us. You should be able to rest in peace in one of our cemeteries. It's your cemetery now, too. Thank you very much. The effort to ensure the Hmong soldiers receive the recognition and honor they deserve will continue. I thank you again for your service and your contribution to our people, mostly for.
farmers who uh, joined with the United States in the interest of preserving freedom and the fundamental human right of self-determination. In 1975, when the U.S. abruptly left Vietnam and Laos, thousands were left to face the communist Pat Dat Lao forces, as Congressman Perlmutter said. Pat Dat Lao were determined to commit genocide on the freedom-loving people in Laos. Many Lao Long people managed uh, dangerous escapes. Introduce the vice chair of the foundation, Commissioner Bill Holland. Bill served with the U.S. Army in Vietnam, the Colorado Air National Guard, worked as an aide to Senator Gary Hart, and later as an aide to Representative uh, Ed Perlmutter. Bill is now in his third term as an elected Arapahoe County Commissioner. Please welcome Commissioner Bill Holt. Thank you very much, John. And I'd like to take a moment of personal uh, pleasure and introduce uh, Barbara Shannon Bannister. Barbara played a significant role in the establishment uh, and and uh, the uh, Aurora of uh, the Aurora uh, National, National the NAACP. And Barbara, could you just stand? She's been a very strong supporter of veterans throughout her career, and is is. Uh, it has contributed greatly to improving the, the racial relationships uh, in our community. And I'd also like to add in that that, that um, uh, this memorial also symbolizes to the, to the Lao Hmong people and to all Asian people that the United States and the majority of our citizens uh, care about you, we want to honor you, and we want you to be our partners in making this a better world. There is no place in this in this uh, uh, world for the hate that we see emerging in this country after so many years of positive uh, support for our uh, upper, for our government and for the people uh, in this country. Thank you. Uh, I'd like to just introduce uh, some of our speakers that will be joining us shortly. Uh, we're honored to have Mayor uh, Nick Size, uh, who is with us. Could you please stand? She has been a terrific supporter of this project. She has worked with the uh, Lao Hmong. Daryl uh, is a uh, is a was a Raven pilot in uh, flying in, out of Thailand, but flying into Laos and uh, supporting U.S. on the war. And uh, uh, I urge you to uh, recognize his c uh, contribution to uh, this ceremony. Thank you. I'd also like to introduce a, a long-term friend, a long-term personal friend, and a strong supporter of the Lao Mon, and that is uh, Brigadier General Tom P.T. Guerrero. Tom. Tom served in the Air National Guard, uh, and uh, he is, he's going to be here uh, to present uh, uh, flowers to our Laotian uh, 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 widows. At this point, I'd like to uh, to uh, have uh, General Pereiro uh, uh, or acknowledge General Pereiro, and also um, I think Major General John Barry is here. I don't see him in the crowd. He's supposed to fly in, but he is a, also a uh, uh, an Air Force uh, fighter pilot, uh, as as was uh, uh, General Pereiro during the Gulf War. Again, thank you, thanks to the uh, Go Mung, Go Tai Mung dance group for their beautiful traditional dancing. And I'd like to, at this point, introduce uh, Yang Ji uh, and welcome him to the, uh, to the podium. Yang Ji was a former college professor.
Nu mă dă, e nouă... Dă că șau... Dă la... 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 U.S. Air Force Yang dikalu U.S. Air Force Ini jilai ya Wapai lu ya Tau sana syai Hai ni syai Ini jilai ya ฉันยังไม่เมย์ไอ้แล้วฉันยังไม่เมย์ทัวร์ร็อกกี้มาวท์เทนเดี๋ยวฉันยังไพรเวทอังกฤษเดี๋ยวจะเป็นไพรเว